As a child, uh, I would say my childhood was actually quite turbulent. So that uh, was a time of reflection for me to really look at, you know, how do I perceive myself truly? To the outside world, I don't believe that was very apparent. You know, we're the ones that know what is going on inside. And, um, but that's one of the reasons probably that the, ch the search began, you know, finding ways to truly fill that void. I was reading about uh, different religions, and I have friends of all faiths, so this is uh, not uh, an offense to any person, you know, and I love people. And um, I don't, for some reason, and I believe now is the Holy Spirit who bears witness to the truth within us, and the truth is written on our hearts. For some reason, every time I picked up a book, you know, I saw the value, I saw some merit, I saw good, but I just said, that's, that's not it, that's not the thing. And then later on, I met another person who I thought seemed more spiritual. And I said, you know, is Jesus God or is Jesus real? And she said something like, well, you know, there are many Christ lights. And when she said that, something in, in my heart just said, that's a lie, that's not true. But that's just what came in, in my heart. And I went home and every other book that I had consulted uh, prior to <laughs> except the Word of God, which has become my favorite book, um, I just threw out. I just felt in my heart, I need to go to church. And I felt something drawing me, calling me. And I remembered when I went to church and I entered into the church, I remembered walking to the front and I, I looked around and I said, oh my God. I said, I, I was with a friend and I said, I've been so far away. I felt that I was a stranger to this, to, to, to God. And um, that the church is a person and that person is Jesus. And he was the one that was drawing me to his word, to his truth, to everything that he so d desires to give us when we say yes to him. I believe most people want meaning in their life. We all have that in common. I think the majority of us want meaning in our lives. And I would say to people, if you get to a point where you have tried everything and it still does not work, I hope you will give Jesus a chance. I hope you will give the faith, the Christian faith a chance. And I promise that you will not lose 